Alfonso, I think it'll be Jake next. Uh, go ahead with question. Alfonso, when was the last time you missed a free throw? Uh, I mean, in this year? That's how I'm 100%. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think. Alfonso, a couple weeks ago, you guys were in Kansas City. You weren't able to overcome a run from Cincinnati. Brad said a lot's changed with practice. You guys come together. Have you kind of noticed something on those lines, too? When did that kind of change? Yeah, I feel like uh, our first win away against Kansas State, um, I feel like we start getting better in defense. Uh, that, that was the main point of the coach. Uh, I think like practice, we play, uh, practicing really hard. Um, so I'm trying to get like better on that end because we know in offense we got all these uh, players, we got a lot of talent. So we're getting better in defense, and I feel like we're doing really good, and we're gonna be way better this season. In terms of you guys coming together, has there been something in practice that's led to you guys having this different continuity, especially going on the road now? You no, know, I feel just like um, you just gotta be more connected. You know what I'm saying? Like we were in the beginning, we we're kind of like everybody have their own space, you know, because we got a lot of freshmen. You know, me, I was a new guy, so we just uh, have to connect, and we did that already. So I feel like that helped us a lot to um, be in the, the place we are right now. Yeah, uh, like I said, um, uh, it's always it's about defense. You know what I'm saying? I would say it's about defense because this team we got Jake, we got uh, Monte, we got Trent, we got obviously Kofi. Um, I think like the check the check box right now is uh, communication on defense, um, rotation. Um, be connect on defense, and I feel like we're going to be a really good team to beat. Coach talked about kind of pick your poison. If you're going to double Kofi, we're going to get Plummer and, and Frazier open threes. If, if you're going to leave Kofi in the second half, we're going to go to him. I mean, do you feel that? Do you feel like it's uh, your hard team to guard right now? I mean, he, like I said before, like Kofi, when he gets two or three guys on him, it's way easier to meet Trent, Jake, to get shots because we got more space to create or like uh, do more plays for the team, you know, to, to make them better. So I feel like when we, we see that every time. Like it's obviously like when like when they do the change, you know what I'm saying? So it's you know, okay, this is the time to get to make shots now. Oh now this is the time to uh pass on the post. You know what I'm saying? So we just get to let the pot, uh that kind of situation every time in, in every game. Alfonso, it seemed like you guys struggled against the press a little bit tonight. What made that so difficult? Uh well we prepared practice. Um but I feel like they did a really good job on the rotation and they got uh length, so it was like long guys. Um Rota uh, rotating, so it's kind of hard like passing the ball across, across the, uh, the court. But like, I feel like at the end of the, the game, it's uh, established uh, to uh, play hard with the ball and stay, and stay focused and just um, you know play with it and we won. It's not too often when a team has a 17-0 run against them and still wins a basketball game. What's it say about you guys and your mental toughness to you know in a game that had spurts left and right to kind of steady in and, and focus and come out of here with a win? Yeah, um, they did, uh, I think, 17 on run. Um, that, was, that was impressive, you know what I'm saying? But I feel like it was about, like I said, on defense. Like, we made a lot of mistakes. They was making shots. Um, they was doing a lot of uh, staggers and players to, for the shooters, and we was making shots. So we had to, like, communicate and be more, like, active um, on the ball and off the ball. Um, I feel like at the end of the game, we uh, figured that out, and we did a really good, good job there. You've been successful from the three-point line this season. What does it mean for you to hit a big one down the stretch for your team? Um, well, my, uh, my workout, you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm always proud of what I do in the court because, because of what I do behind the cameras, behind the media. I'm always working on my game, trying to get better. And when something like that happens, it just made me proud and happy. Did you see that? Yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm always focused on, on the uh, court. Alfonso, you've got five big games, so 20 points. Have you ever been on a stretch like this in your career? How confident are you right now shooting the ball? Not in, I don't think in college. Um, I did in high school and, and, and junior college. So this is like my first time career in NCAA Division I doing that. And I'm very proud, I'm, I'm uh, very proud of what, of what I'm doing because, like I said, my work ethic is healthy. How much do you guys talk about a game like this being important to try to win a Big Ten title? How important it is? Yeah. Uh, well, it's. I mean, the main goal, you know what I'm saying, we're always trying to like try to be the best play, uh, the best players, the best team in the nation. And I feel like we, we're doing, we doing a really good job. We started in a good way. So we're going to keep doing what, what we're doing and get better and get connected and uh, uh, win the championship. Thank you. Thank you.